All right, welcome back. Continuing with our new uh, series on our, our new rendezvous and proximity, proximity operation sequences, um, we're going to talk a little bit about the coast sequence today. And so I'm going to look in uh, just from the default files that we do load, there's actually a coast sequence in the default RPO satellite. Um, and that's this guy here. And um, before I do that, I'm actually going to go and set my initial state differently so we can see, visualize this, visualize this a little bit better. I'm going to actually start on um, 100 meters on the uh, R bar and then um, just zero meters there and in track. Um, and then uh, from the co sequence, I'll t tell you a little bit about it. Um, this uh, co sequence, it can propagate to a stopping condition, it can propagate to um, durations or can propagate to revs, uh, to a number of revs. So you have those different options here. Um, and it's meant to propagate a satellite until one of those three things happens. Uh, if you want to, you can actually go into the coast sequence and change the default propagator, but as it is, the default propagator is the Earth H pop default version 10. Um, and so depending on what we choose here, whether we choose uh, a duration, revs, um, or a stopping condition, then we pick how we want to find our coast stopping condition. Uh, so there's our options there. And so right now it's set on duration. Um, and let's go ahead and with what we have here, just go ahead and run this guy. And then we're going to go ahead and set our animation time to the beginning of the coast sequence. Um, and we will zoom to this guy in the 3D graphics. And so um, recall that we started at 100 meters along the R bar with respect to our target vehicle. So that's where our initial state that we set there was. Um, and then because we are not at the same place, as we propagate forward, we're going to drift around in, in proximity of the target. And so that's what we end up with here for our um, where our RPO satellite starts. Um, and let's go ahead and play that and kind of see what it does. And you see it start to, to move away. Um, and actually speed up a little bit as we go. And so just given that different initial state, um, as we coast, in this sense, under natural forces, we're not going to stay where the other, where the target is at, but we'll drift away. Um, and so that's how the coast segment works. Um, and that can be found if it's not, you know, it is here in the default. If it's not there, um, or if you're building another one, you can add additional coast go ahead and go into the RPO configuration folder and find Coast there. Um, all right. Thanks. Stay tuned for other ones.